performance. How did it feel to not only come off an African record not too long ago, but now here in Boston, another African record? Let me tell you, it's been God. It's been God. Seven, 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 five. We know God nice. I'm just thankful to be out here um, using my God's giving talent to, you know, put the world out. And this guy from Africa, from Nigeria. And he's like, did you like coming into the season? Did you have a record on your mind? Did you have running 777 times? Of course, we have goals that um, I just set out and my coach would be walking towards those goals that, you know, I'm just praying for help and take one minute out of time. Can you talk about the training and preparation coming off of 2023 and now leading into this year? I mean, 2023 was a rough one, I must say, but truly really helps through down, God has been faithful and I'm just. Looking forward to this and next phase of the season, the which is the year does, and we'll see what all does bring. Do you intend to do the world indoors in Glasgow? Do you, yes. do you intend to do the world indoors in Glasgow? Um, so, coming into this meet, right, we didn't have um, plans of running the world indoors, but myself and coach had an agreement. You run 377s, you go to world indoors, and I say that. So this is the second one, let's see. <laughs> You're already world record holder outdoor. Now as you kind of continue to creep up, do you have that world record on your mind indoors? I Honestly, yeah. yeah, you know, knowing that the first 500 is not my forte, and you know, we're working really hard to get that part of my race out. And with the way things are going, why not? I'll do it, you know, one record holder sounds great. <laughs> Given that you they appealed your whereabouts face to the Court of Arbitration of Sport, is it difficult with that in the back of your mind? Do you think about that much at all? I'm just looking forward to the season and nobody's gonna know when the case is. I'm just looking forward to the season. I'm curious, you don't we don't have too many Nigerians who represent during the indoor season, right? What does it mean to be a Nigerian out here, potentially going to world indoor terms and all that? Uh, you know, Kathy Shad is from being a Nigerian and coming to the US. We don't have indoor basketball. So it's somewhat different for us. And, you know, getting adjusted to the system here and trying to, you know, do things that we normally don't do. So it's a, it's a great way to head in the past. We are in a, a great direction. Knowing that we don't do indoor. And now we're taking up the running for the USA. Thank you.